the Westminster Dog Show kicked off in New York City on Monday. Thousands of dogs from across the country are competing for the top award. CBS's Nikki Batiste met some of the canine contenders. This beauty pageant for dogs has an Olympic-like event to compete in, too. The annual Westminster Dog Show is a paw-filled parade of the country's top dogs. Some people spend hundreds of thousands of dollars. Dia Freiheit is co-owner of five-year-old Rembrandt, an old English sheepdog who is vying for a blue ribbon. His pre-show pampering will take six hours, but he doesn't seem to mind. I always tell people, you know, if I could lay on a table and have somebody groom me for hours and hours, I'd love, I'd be loving that too. So yeah, in life, buddy. Yeah. yeah. Oh, look. 2,800 dogs are competing this year, separated into about 200 breed categories. Winter is an English Mastiff, and she'll be competing for best of breed against 21 others. She's hoping for a shot at that best in show title. Two-year-old George is a standard poodle. This is a continental cut. It takes about two and a half, three hours to get him ready before a show, so that's where we're at. His handler, Chelsea Paul, says he's making his show ring debut. Who gets more pampering, you or him? Oh, definitely him. It's pretty clear that most of these pups, win or lose, are pretty doggone happy. Nikki Batiste, CBS News, New York. The Best in Show winner will be announced tonight at Madison Square Garden. There's no prize money, but the winner will take home a trophy and pride.